I feel like this whole video is just going to be Shara like, going, mm -hmm. I didn't know that. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> <exactly>. <laughs> wow. Welcome to Tokyo Tuesday. If you're a regular viewer, Welcome back. <laughs> Today, we are talking about Shinkansen's. In fact, I'm giving you guys 10 facts about Shinkansen's, or the bullet train, if you will. For those of you who don't know, this is Sherry from Sherry Berry and Ehime. This is only her second Shinkansen ride ever, yes. so she'll be joining me today. Let's just jump right into this. All right, here we go. Fact the first. The very first Shinkansen was launched on October 1st of 1964. Did you know that? No, I didn't know that. Do you know what that was just in time for? That was <laughs> Tokyo Olympics, right? Yes, the very yes. first Tokyo Olympics held right here in Japan. Just on time for that. Cool. So that's fact number one. Let's go on to number two. So let's talk about Shinkansen's speed. Do you know how fast the very first Shinkansen went? Very first Shinkansen. Very first. Like 80 kilometer per hour? It was actually 130 miles per hour. Okay. That's 209 kilometers an hour for the very first Shinkansen ever made. Wow. <laughs> it was way off. How about now? Do you know what the fastest Shinkansen is? Um, like around, I, I thought it was like around the same, like 200, no? The current fastest Shinkansen is 200 miles per hour. Miles per hour? Yeah. So like 300 kilometer per hour? 320 kilometers per hour. Wow. Yeah. That's crazy. That's a real thing. Mind you, they have done tests where the Shinkansen has reached up to 275 miles an hour. Whoa. Yeah. That's like 443 kilometers an hour. Here's a little known fact. Did you know that they actually had a lot of trouble getting the wheels to work? You see, the train, they hadn't designed any trains to go that speed before, so the wheels were experiencing this drift that could have totally derailed the train, and they had to build entirely new technology to dampen the wheels and stop them from drifting. Wow. Additionally, during the initial test of it, the wheels started to suffer drift once again, and they thought they were going to have to scrap the whole project. Whoa, that sounds kind of scary. But the drift stopped. They worked out the bugs, and here we are now, cool. sitting on a Shinkansen, several decades later. <laughs> Did you know that every cabin of the Shinkansen is pressurized, just like an airplane? <gasps> Where did you know that? It has to be. Wow. Well, we're it's... going through a tunnel right now, right? Right. The pressure that's in the tunnels is absolutely incredible. I'm gonna throw a bonus fact in here. There's a moment when the Shinkansen enters a tunnel that actually creates the sound of a sonic boom. Hmm. And it's believed that it has enough power to knock a freight train right off the rails, so they actually have to be careful when freight trains and Shinkansens are passing each other. So there's a speed limit within tunnels. How did you know that? Yeah. Wow. Quick fact, super right. quick. Do you know how many fatalities there have been on the Shinkansen since its initial release? I don't know. Take a guess. Why? One thousand? No, that, that's too many. One hundred? One hundred fatalities since the release of the Shinkansen? Yeah. The actual number is zero. <gasps> wow. Despite earthquakes and tsunamis and everything like that, there yeah. has never been a single fatality on a Shinkansen, which means it can arguably said that it is one of the safest methods of transportation in the entire world. Yeah, I was amazed by that. Yeah. I'm pretty sure that's actually a pretty common fact. Really? So, a lot of you guys might already know that one. Do you know how many trains run daily? That's like so many, right? 10,000 trains? 10,000, okay. Going over and uh, <laughs> no. going high on all these. No. No, okay. <laughs> I have no idea. Upwards of almost as many as a thousand trains a day. Actually, it's closer to 800 trains a day. Okay. But that's still, it's a lot of trains. Yeah, it's a lot, still. And although we haven't gotten to see it on this trip, there's a crew that can clean the entire train in under 10 minutes. Wow. Yeah, look how clean these are. Oh yeah. One of the neat things is... Wow. Yeah. 
So they go through and they clean the entire train. I think it's like seven minutes or something. Whoa. Yeah. World record. They pick up all the garbage, they clean the bathrooms, they do everything. Oh yeah, they have bathrooms too. Yeah. I think they have a special name too, like 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 the Shinkansen Theater or something. <laughs> Seriously. Yeah? Yeah. Wow. They're they're amazing. They're like zip, zip, zip. super quick on, on the different type of seats that are available on the Shinkansen. So right now we're sitting in the reserved car. There's also non-reserved. There's green car, which is kind of like first class, and then there's like grand class. And grand class looks like this. This is what the first class car looks like. They even have their own attendant. And this here is what the normal first class looks like. It's called a green car. That brings us back to the normal seats. With Sherry. Hi. So that was grand class, the green car, and, and the one that we're sitting in Regular. right now. <laughs> also, I was wearing my pink jacket when I recorded that. Additionally, there are non-reserved seats, and on incredibly crowded routes, some people even stand. Wow, for like a couple hours? Yep. Whoa, I don't want to do that. Yeah. The tenth official and final fact about the Shinkansen. Did you know that these seats that we're sitting in right now actually swivel around? <gasps> I kind of knew it. But I don't know how, and I saw like they have like special seats for that. You see those little foot pedals at the bottom? Oh yeah. You stomp on the foot pedal, you pull it out, you spin it. <gasps> Just like that. Wow. Yeah. I kinda wanna do that now. Last year when I traveled up north with a bigger group, we got a set of four seats and we turned them around so we were all facing each other. Yeah, I, I, I saw that video, but I thought like you got like, you know, four seats facing together, got a special seat. Nope. And you know that cleaning crew that we talked about? Yeah. When the train reaches either end and switches directions, not only do they clean, but they turn all the seats around all within the same time frame. All the seats? All the seats for the entire train. <laughs> the more modern trains actually have seats that like automatically turn around, I believe. I feel like I've seen it, so. And guys, that is all the facts about the Shinkansen. Learned a lot. Yeah, and actually if you guys do want to see Sherry's first time on the Shinkansen ever, it was a blast. <laughs> but this is Sherry's first time ever on a bullet train. Yes! How do you feel? Exciting, isn't it? Yeah, it's so exciting. Because in Shikoku, we don't have Shinkansen at all. So. No, you should have seen her before she got on the train. She was like excited, like a little kid, like oh, <laughs> looking around, like like. I definitely recommend watching it. It was a lot of fun. I'll leave it right here, and I'll leave it at the end because it's just it's that good. If you haven't seen it. Go see it. Outside of that, do you have any questions about Shinkansen, Sherry? What's the name of this Shinkansen? The Shinkansen that we're on right yeah. now is called the Hayabusa. Ooh. White, green, and pink Shinkansen. I love the shape. It's very modern. So like this is be only between the Tohoku area and Tokyo? Yep. So this one doesn't run down to Kyoto or Osaka or oh. anything. They have other less beautiful Shinkansen <laughs> for that. I They're see. fast. They're fast. But they just... They don't look as nice as this one. The interior pretty much looks almost the same. Well, thank you for joining me, Sherry. Yeah, thank you. And thank each and every single one of you for joining. I loved having you here. Seriously, thank you. If you guys enjoyed this video, definitely give that like button some love. Leave me something in the comments. Do you have any questions? Do you have a favorite Shinkansen, a favorite train, a favorite route? I want to hear about it. A favorite destination, maybe. Thank you once again, as always. And guys, you know, I'll see you again real soon.